Hey guys, it's Nico, and coming. I'm coming at you with weekly update number 12. And today I have a special guest. But first of all, but first off, happy Easter, everybody. I apologize for this video being late. Um, and yeah, I have uh, XXX Fluffy Dog XXX here with me. I was originally supposed to have Lego Boy one through eight here. I just didn't get a chance to call him, so I'll just call him up tomorrow, I guess, or something. I don't know, for the next video that I might do. And, yeah. So, Tommy, uh, say hi. Hello. Hope you guys can hear him. Um, yeah, guys, and I think it's an editing error with this camera. So, if it shuts off in the, at the end of the video, I apologize. Um, you know, I'm just letting you guys know early on that it does that. So, yeah, here you can see I have the custom minifigures for the Galidron mock, which I will be showing you guys in a minute. Um, still haven't put the ATXT together, which I received from LEGO 714616. Um, I'm doing a trade with him for like two ships that I really don't need for that. As you can see, I still haven't put together that Snow Trooper Battle Pack. Oh, you guys are probably wondering what I got for Easter. Well, I got $20 from my stepdad. Um, I got it in that egg right there, and then I got some candy. I already ate the uh, Hershey uh, Hershey Kiss uh, Hershey Kisses uh, with the uh, almond inside it. I already ate that, and these are little coffee things. I just tried one, and it doesn't taste too good. Um, yeah, so these forty bucks that I'm saving because I was originally supposed to give twenty to um, Lego seven seven one four six four one six. I was supposed to, um, I was supposed to, uh, <laughs> uh, give him money for that, but I haven't had time to run down to the post office, so, um, I just decided instead to save me money, I'm just going to trade two of the ships, uh, that I'm not really using anymore, um, and those are like two Imperial ships, but, yeah, I wasn't going to use them anyway, but, yeah, so, anyway, I'm off topic, I also got... Um, a little gift basket right there, and what I got in there was another Rebel Battle Pack. I like the speeders, guys, don't get me wrong. And I have a few Rebel Troopers. I still have the Rebel Troopers here in my Legion Zero, right there in the back. It was right under my Horn Company. And by the way, I will be getting Tommy's Captain Locke in the mail really soon to um, lead the Horn Company. Isn't that right, Tommy? Yes, it is. Okay. And um, I'm going to get a lot more battle packs now that I started up that whole um, company right there. And, uh, hmm, what else to show you guys? Oh. I'm going to use that 40 bucks on the Lego Star trip, which will be this week. I'll record this um, that trip this time for sure, I hope, because the last two times I didn't get a chance to um, do it. And yeah. Oh, got two of those mini ATSDs. That's just my little thing from my desk. It just dropped. I got to retape it. So, off to my garage to show you guys the mocks, which I've been working on. By the way, guys, <coughs> excuse me, I'm just getting over uh, um, bronchitis. <coughs> For those of you who don't know what bronchitis is, it's what smokers have, except it's called chronic bronchitis, which means they have that all the time. Me, it's just a sickness, <coughs> as you all can tell. So, here is the battle for Thule, Jedi versus Sith. As you can see, the temple is a piece of crap right now, I know. However, I'm getting more black bricks from CLAT79 to finish up these walls and do a little bit more detailing inside. And yes, I will do more detailing out here in the exterior. I know one particular person who gets on me about my detail and my inaccuracy on certain planets. But, however, I'm not doing this to impress the bigger people on YouTube. I'm doing this for the fans because that's what you guys want me to do. So, 
yeah, and like, I don't know why I'm following what the B-Man 610 said, but mocks are for coolness, in quote, rather than, uh, you know, uh, accuracy. However, that just depends on who you are, <clears throat> Tom. And by Tom, I meant Perfector. So as you can see, I have my bow for my Guido Bridge mock, which a lot of you thought was epic, and most of you thought it was epic. So, um, yeah, this is just too good to take down immediately, so I just decided to leave it up. I mean, I love it a lot. Took me a little bit to make this uh, blown up turbo tank right here, but, you know, it was no biggie. And as you can see, I have my Galidron mock right here as well. You know, still working on that. I, um, and this is the mock that um, is going to be uh, used. Um, those figures are going to be used in. I'm sorry, I'm just a little bit off right now. And if you're wondering why I have Death Watch Mandalorians, is because, you know, to get, like, the Mandalorians that I use to make my Jango Fett, it's really hard, because I only know one site that carries them, you know, and that's CAC, and that's very expensive. So I just cut off half the Mandos that I have. I put the, uh, like, half of them as Death Watch, and then half of the other half as uh, True Mandalorians. These are the True Mandalorians. As you can see, there's a lot of detail throughout this mock, but I'll get more into that later on. So, uh, more on the full mock. This will be kind of like an open fortress, and you'll probably see um, Jedi and Sith battling inside the temple itself and outside here. I'm probably going to take most of the detailing gray pieces that I have and put them out here. As you can see, it's all, you know, just bare. And over there, I haven't had a chance to work on the Delta Squad Rescue Mock because I need to make a bunker. And if I don't get the chance to buy the Bell for Endor set for that bunker, I'm going to just use that bunker and, you know, work with the all the gray pieces that I have. And then, you know, I'll start working on that. But anyways... I've just been working on this mock. I've been rustling around for black bricks, and these are all the black bricks that I could find. As you can see, I'm not like Lego Bob 35. I do not have like two, uh, 2,000 uh, white, um, you know, black bricks. By the way, Lego Bob, if you're watching this, um, you know, good job on a few of the mocks. Uh, all I can say is you're doing pretty well in the contest, and you know, there's a, quite a few other people, but. Um, yeah, and I do use flats, and, I just, and if you, as you all, most of you know, you stack three flats together of the same thing, and it equals um, the size of a brick. So I've just been looking around for those as well, and I managed to like find uh, two levels of uh, full bricks going around the entire um, thing. And I originally had these shuttles for the clones uh, for the Jedi side, but I figure I'm just going to use the Republic attack shuttles for this. So yeah, I'm going to take one sh attack shuttle out of there and then put it over here. Um, and yeah, it looks okay. I mean, of course, there's going to be a lot of detailing done to it. And there's going to be a lot more done to this bare space right here. And if I can't do any more detailing, I'm going to take a few of these base plates out and then use like four of them for a different sort of mock. That or like you know, just like uh, take take these four blade places off and then use um, them over there and make a totally different mock and then just use the temple um, for this sort of mock. That's what I'll probably do because I don't I don't feel like detailing all of this. I don't really know what to do because you know I want to do something different, not just always like detailing you know on the. Uh, gray um base plates so yeah just aside from that nothing else just been working on this thing non-stop um as well as uh trying to wait for the figures for that by the way i'm getting a count dooku like i said in the other video i'm getting a count dooku um younger version when he was a jedi i'm getting one uh from clat 79 who is also sending my geonosians out and also he is going to try his best to help me out with a few of these bricks like he said, he'll try to get uh, a brick order, and he'll send it to me. I didn't ask him for it, he just suggested it. 
So, you know, I said thank you and all that. But, um, yeah, so just quite a few figures coming my way. So you guys will be pretty happy to see what I got next update. So, anyways, Tommy, anything you want to say? Yeah, if you guys watched uh, um, me just showing the uh, figures on the last uh, um, update, you guys will know what figure, what new figures you guys will be getting um, for the contest. For those of you who have entered, as you, there's like one new figure that I got in there, and you guys will you know see. But um, I'll do an update on that once I get the customs from Tommy, and a review on his Captain Lock will be this month. So. Yeah, um, please rate, comment, subscribe, subscribe to Tommy, subscribe to me.